Alright, let's watch the video. The meta is about to change. Alright. The Kims always wins. A lot of you have been waiting for me to release this video unveiling my broken tech ever since I made Okay, he's starting to downplay it. So I've discovered something in Ultimate. An application of a known mechanic, and I'm afraid that if I release it, it'll actually be really bad for the metagame. I have no idea if it would ever get patched out. I know it'll eventually get found out, though. If it's footstooling, I'm gonna be it mad. Might be bad for the metagame. But after labbing it a bit more, I'd rather just showcase it to you guys. And let the pros prove how good it is. Oh my <laughs> fucking god! I'm so. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I talked about the end. Cool. The fuck? People do that all the time. It's game I do that all the time. Game Oh, it's invincible, As though. You can see, yeah, okay. but it's, a, it's always been invincible. Oh, yeah, yeah, thanks so much. Why is this possible? This works because once your double jump is burned, every time you tap the jump button, footstool is buffered under you for seven frames. Yeah. All right, boys, start mashing. I actually do that. <laughs> so if you press jump eight or nine times a second, you have this footstool box under you continuously. In Ultimate, they added four frames of intangibility to the beginning of footstool animations. And phantom footstools make you fly really high, really quickly. Yeah. Uh, okay. Okay. Let's let's try it. Okay. Try to footstool against Squirtle up here, because I feel like that might be applicable against Squirtle. With just with yeah. whoever. Okay. Nope. I mash that jump to most of the reset. Yeah. It worked that time. I think I, I do think Squirtle okay. is like one of the characters where it could could definitely happen sometimes. Can you just hold up if you have tap jump? Oh, I'm Oh, okay. Wait, really? Oh, they moved that automatically. They are neutral. So, for the command, So, apparently, if you if you have tap jump, it just keeps buffering. Tap jump has a use. Oh. Double jump. Yeah. Double jump. He's just holding it. Yeah. I like how I like how Gimmer made an eight minute video and missed the actual important part of it. Yeah. <laughs> Which is tap jump makes it more consistent. <laughs> That's pretty stupid that you can just hold the jump. But you can't, can you drift? Yeah, I can. Yeah, because you- Like if you're holding diagonally up, yeah, it still works. But you have to hold up. So the difference is if you're- Yeah, if it's, you're not, it's not always consistent. But if you have, if you have jump on, like, uh, if you don't have tap jump on, you can drift harder and sp mash A, which you can't with tap jump on. Yeah, but I don't know how much the, the it buffers. But you lose some drift with tap jump, yeah. on the, basically. Uh, on the there are pros and cons. Yeah. Like, but, so against any disjoint, it doesn't work. Basically. So so it's basically like anti Mario, anti Squirtle. Like, yeah. Oh anti maybe maybe Luigi. wait wait let's try Pikachu. I think Pikachu it could be very useful. Yeah. No, this doesn't affect Inkfo Inkling up dropper. It's a true combo for the most part. Yep. Okay. Oh. Okay. Yeah, hold that bubble. Yeah, this guy's like Rage is just holding straight up on tap jump. That's. <laughs> Such a bad program. <laughs> Alright, we need to test what more characters is worth it. Pikachu. Wait, wait, I need to click this. Pikachu P obsolete. P Pikachu molding. <laughs> molding. <laughs> what happened? Did you sing this? He's sim quaking. <laughs> <laughs> you sing one simple trick. Holding up. Like, do Pikachu's even up there to anti air? Like, don't they, they like they, 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 fire they, or bear instead to catch land? It's, it's not a huge thing. Yeah. Like, like you definitely do it, but. Like a lot of the time when you do it, it deals with like four percent, man. Yeah, but it, at least the combos. That's why you do it. Yeah, I guess. But you don't gain anything from it. Like you don't lose, nor I mean. Well, if you're like a, if you're like recovering or something I like guess. that. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. It's just stupid that you can be like, I'm just gonna hold up, because it, it make. So what I'm thinking is that you can do like, if you don't have a double jump, you fast fall, and then you hold up, and then you like buffer under ground option. So that becomes a lot stronger. Oh. Because like, let, let's imagine I'm holding shield here mm -hmm. and I'm trying to up smash out of shield. Like mm -hmm. it becomes really, really hard to time the up smash before you can land in mm -hmm. shield. I'm, I'm gonna get a tap jump. Yeah, this is very bad like programming. I agree. It's gonna be so stupid if that's the meta, just like people just hold up. <laughs> Boing. Well, it's going to be most important for characters that struggle coming down. So I actually think it's gonna be good for PT for example. So, the tech that I developed, this is, or <laughs> I developed, <laughs> you know, the, the meta that I will change, that I personally ch change by bringing a rage over here and having it explained to me, is uh, tap jump infinitely buffers it. Yeah. 
<laughs> That's so stupid. <laughs> Left tapping. Yeah, it, 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 it does actually help PT specifically since PT is one of the few top tiers that is like really bad at landing. Dude, if I can just do that. But like, if, if I swap midair. Oh, wait. It I, gives you free swaps as well. Because you can swap after you uh, double or after yeah, you but I, I think it's mostly because like a lot of the times when you swap, they're going to be under you and then they jump to upper you. Yeah. And now you can just like super easily just fully like jump really high and then swap. Yeah, you just jump like this and then if they try to hit you, it's oh okay. You just buffer. But I mm -hmm. think Pichu Pichu seems better at like not getting hit by it. Let me try by doing like mashing jump. It even works too. Maybe if you time it. Yeah, but timing timing is the like what we don't want. Okay. I don't know how, how how like the buffer works for this one. Like, can I? Can you buffer a move? Wait, so so just so just jump towards me. I'm gonna I'm gonna hold jump. No, it doesn't seem to buffer. Wait. I don't yeah. count as one. Input. Exactly. Yeah, but tap jump tap jump like breaks it. You just hold up. That's so, that's so weird that like tap jump specifically keeps buffering, whereas pressing X like doesn't. You probably don't need tap jump to. To make use of the tactic, but it definitely feels like tap jump just makes it very trivial. Can you buffer an aerial out of it? Like, so can you, can you punish people if they extend their hurt box? Like uh, some characters could, like the maybe. like icy and CSS downer, for example. Oh yeah. Maybe, maybe Bayo downer too. Like, I doubt Ivy saw as a downer will reach. Yeah, it's probably easier to get the footstool if I fast fall. You I get always, it, but you're not invincible. That yeah, because Peach's yeah. upper has too much range. Yeah. But I think that's generally going to be in the meta that you hmm. fast fall and then up B. So you always get the footstool because it's way harder to time the up B if, um, if you're fast falling. It works on Fox up tilt. <gasps> yeah, this is basically RNG juggling. Sakura was like edge guarding with two frames. It's random, but you can still consistently juggle people. Buddy, thanks so much. I doubt Palo. It's on Gekko Palo's upper. Really? Oh. It works on Palo upper? He has that idea. It doesn't seem to work on Fox. It could be because he's too... Um, wait. Yeah, the upper like reaches too far. Oh. Yeah, see. Maybe on a... Uh, try up tilting. <laughs> Seems pretty consistent. On up tilt. And they probably go for up smash. Oh, up smash? <laughs> <laughs> oh no! <laughs> That's so. <laughs> no! It really was like juggling was too consistent. Well, Gamer was right, but. Tap jump is the reason why this is so consistent. Come on, dude. <laughs> I have to use like the back part of my up tilt for it to work. I mean, up air. Wait, wait. I'm gonna be fucking mad if this works. Oh, okay. It, it works, but... No! <laughs> why? Okay. <laughs> it's like actually pretty consistent, even against fucking Ivy up there. All tap jump users are forever redeemed. See, I told you! I wasn't just using it. Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> no! I wanna, I wanna see the Palo up here. No way it works on Palo. Gonna work. Oh yeah, you you guys were talking about that before. I heard you t oh. mention. These guys were talking about like before the video, like oh yeah, you can do this this on Snake up to. <laughs> I can't believe Gamer killed two Smash games. This legitimately makes juggling RNG just like edge guarding. 
Sword characters are buffed. That's what we need, all needed. Actually, let me try Wolf first. Because Wolf has like a claw. I don't know if it counts as a disjoint. Game of Watch buffed, that's true. <laughs> oh god. That's so stupid. Uh, who? Right, Wario. Wario. Wait, wait, uh, wait, let's check out. Oh, th this is the important. That's actually huge against Wario. Because Wario wants to use late up till too. <laughs> yeah, let's try Inkling. Can you do it while in Tumble? I don't know. I don't think so, yeah. Let, let me see if I Alps smash you and see if you can tap jump. No, yeah, you, you you can't do it out of tumble. Yeah, so so like characters that can do a quick move, like let's say Squirtle up air, to like quickly reset them into non tumble, that really helps. Test that yummy. Okay. Test out. Oh. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it doesn't work in tumble. Okay. Let me try up air. Boing. Point? Okay, that 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 time your short jump was like too short. Dude, I'm gonna circle camp people with Joker, so hard. <laughs> and just down guns, and then whenever they approach me, boy, boy. Uh, uh, so it doesn't work against swords. Yeah, let's try this again. So the reason why tap jump is different is because tap jump just keeps buffering. <laughs> I don't feel like it will work. What? It like sometimes works against fucking Lucina up there. <laughs> Dude, fighting game over the year 2019. That makes no sense. Wait, what about Uppy? That's so, so weird. Yeah, this is kind of really bad for Lucina. Because Lucina doesn't have too many true combos either. So, this actually. Fuck, Sosina. <laughs> it just looks so stupid. It's like, what's happening? Does someone describe what the fuck's happening right here? I mean, there is. Don't get me wrong. There is definitely still going to be used for, for moves. And I think, like, you're overreacting if you think it's going to kill the game. It's just a really, really stupid mechanic. I feel like Chrome Supper will be fat. Uh. Yeah, if I space it like very properly. And if I like do falling maybe, yeah, like that, it's harder. No, this does not buff Puff. I, I don't think. It buffs characters that have trouble coming down. And it nerfs sword characters. Greninja? Not on Greninja? Okay. <laughs> I feel like it probably works if I don't do it. Oh? It, it, if I do it like rising, I, I catch you. But if I do like jump and then up air, you, you get it every time. Yeah, it's not the up air that's too fast. It's essentially just Greninja's jump height. Yeah, I, w I would say it nerves characters that have trouble to land and characters that are just good, good when being above. So like Joker's better. I could see Snake being better. Because Snake can just like up be high every time and then just mash jump. And then like all you footstool, drop C4, another nade. Ken Shuriuken. Oh, I want to try that. Okay, so if you if if it's at the very beginning of your jump, oh yeah, if you space it exactly. But if I like fall past you, it's really hard. And again, like if you fast fall, this becomes even harder. So it's like you have so so little timing variation before I actually let, hit the ground. It seems at least very inconsistent. Maybe if I jump. Oh uh, okay. Yeah, you probably have to like sweet spot the spacing. Wow. Alright, up here. Yeah, this is, this is inconsistent. Might depend on character though. 
Yeah, let's try can show you. I mean, I don't think they're gonna patch this, sadly. Like, I legitimately don't think they're going to patch this. Uh, it, seems, it seems like it has too big of a hitbox. Yeah. Like, even if you get it, so a lot of the time he will just, like, catch you. It might make the make it kill later. Why sad that happened? Don't you think if some of the, these broken mechanics get discovered, it could lead to tech similar to melee? No, I actually do not think this is going to lead to melee. <laughs> I actually think there is no chance whatsoever that melee movement is going to come out of holding up the footstool. <laughs> I think if I space it, yeah. What about fair? <laughs> yeah, fair. Fair seems hard. Oh yeah, serious suit Samus. I don't think up smash, but I do think serious suit Samus up fair. Cruel up B. I think cruel up B is consistently for school I feel like CSS jumps too fast. Yeah. She, she, she seems like Greninja. If you do it falling... Like... Yeah. Wait, what? Why does it work against CSS up smash sometimes? This is like the one move it should never work against. I also think it working against up smashes might be a bigger deal because you will get punished for up smashes for a lot of these characters. Yeah, it's like inconsistent, but it definitely can work against up smash. It makes the timing very predictable. You have to do it really fast. Wait, wait, wait. wait. This is important. Does Peach just straight up ignore this? No. It seems to be inconsistent versus Peach. Fucking privileged characters. Oh yeah, Rob. If you try and stay behind Peach, it's much easier to put still up there. Okay. Did you know about the tap jump thing, Gamer? Yeah, if you fast fall though, it becomes like, you can time it for sure. But it becomes way harder. Yeah, I think the reason why they added this mechanic is so that you can recover and footstool people. And like, you can jump on up ease easily. Can we go back to the time where chat thought Gamer was full of shit? Mm, Ness maybe? He does use his hand, so I feel like this is a character that could be borderline. Uh, what other character should we try? Um... Try ter uh, Terry. Yeah, it, it does not work. Uh, it's too disjointed. Oh yeah, Falcon Upper. It probably works in Falcon Upper. Yeah, Lu Lucina actually dead. He's trying out different moves. It's, it's bad against Greninja. I'm pretty sure Link will just clear, cleanly hit you. Bowser apparently was good against it. Um, I guess Ridley. It seems like kind of inconsistent against what? the upper. It has massive range. But it still works sometimes. Let me try Nair. This is a lot of really do Nair like that. Uh, up tools. Wait. Yeah, uh, up tools is joint. I think the same problem smash. I, like, I wouldn't be surprised if this buffs, like, sn Snake the most. He's a character that, like, willingly puts himself in that position. No double jump, high above you. Let's try Young Link. Where's Young Link?
Yeah, it, it, it's it's like it seems really hard unless maybe I'm like falling or something Yeah, it works against Ivy sadly It does not work very well against Joker because if he does rising up air he hits you and Generally with Joker you do rising up air Yeah, it's like it's, even against fucking young and semi consistent Charizard up smash goes through it Charizard up B, it does not work with, and it does not work. Uh, I mean, you can't up air consistently either. Squirtle up air is also fucked. Yeah, first one seems consistent here. Backman is surprisingly, like, not dead to this. It does not work against Olimar. So stupid. I, that has to be like the worst feeling, like tournament situation, you're trying to upper someone, boing? It's so random, like it's more consistent against Lucina's up tilt than DK's up tilt. Like why? Wait, Falco up tilt? I don't think it works against Falco up tilt. <laughs> okay, alright, if I'm early enough, it doesn't work every time. <laughs> Well, this is even working some of the time against Falco is like a big fucking deal. Falco's up smash already never worked. Yeah, I don't think Salem is right that he says it sucks with Joker. I don't think that's accurate. Like, why, why would why would it suck with Joker? I don't think his jump is very short. We can, I mean, we can ch check, but I'm pretty sure his jump is fine enough. You know. Footstool was the fifth character. <laughs> it's like Joker, Hero, Banjo, Terry. Footstooling joins the fight. Seems to work with Joker. Maybe he meant that like Joker's bad against it, but I don't necessarily think that's true. He still has like up air. I mean up B. You probably wait. Try jumping my up tilts. Yeah, I, I, there's no chance you're gonna do that one like i don't think you can jump oh maybe oh yeah i actually think the hitbox might be the same yeah exactly the hitbox is the same yeah it, if you like space this light with joker like horizontally it's like it would be hard for a lot of characters especially if you like double jump right before you do it i think a lot of characters will get caught yeah like that oh shit Wait wait wait, 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 we, we, we found more stuff. So, this thing. Cool thing to note about Panda Futsu is if you air dodge frame one or two after performing it, basically at the same time, you can air dodge with no gap in your intangibility. But they broke it today, we can battle with him now. Oh, wait, 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 let's try this, let's try this. All right, so if you air dodge down, when you do this, Because of bat within, that happens. Yeah, this this thing you actually like have to kind of like time it. And Joker's Joker's like upper move specifically is good against this. But this is definitely going to be good against like wait. Let's try like Krom. Because Krom was like one of the characters where like you you could jump but you wouldn't get out. I mean to be fair, you don't really challenge Bay when she's in the air. <laughs> but it's cool to add, yeah. No, it, it's not frame perfect or anything because of the buffer. Like, as soon as the footstool jump, like, starts jumping, which is a little bit, you can do it. But it's definitely not easy. Yeah, I mean, if they want to fix this, it won't be that hard. But that will require them to actually pay attention to the competitive scene, which they won't. Like, I'm sure Sakura will just be like, no, I want people to be able to upbeat through when they're recover. I mean, footstool when they're recovering for free. We can't change this. Wow, way more well, the real effect of this is not going to be that you rare, like, you intentionally use your double jump like instantly. That's not really realistic. the re The real use is going to be, um, you will double jump out of more situations and air dodge less in the beginning because being above someone without your double jump is now way, way like way better. Depending on the character, of course, but yeah. What 
the fuck? <laughs> hey, I want to try something with the with the footstool thing. Pick pick Mario, because people are saying like, oh, it's useless because you will just like, what are you gonna do? You're just gonna get foot like you're just gonna have to land later anyway. But I don't think that's true. So like, stand here and do like jumping up or like that. Like you're not it, even if you just do full jump up air, like it's not that easy. <laughs> like you can chase that. Like people legitimately think that you like fly into the blast zone. <laughs> mm -hmm. Like hero. Like that it's not at all how it works. Even with Mario, like even if you're fast, like if there's platforms, there's no fucking way you're gonna chase that. Especially like with Joker. Oh my god. Yeah. Wait, can I down him? Jesus. I I think Downer gets it too. Oh my god. Alright, do do rising downer. Come on. This is just not Yeah, like nice. like you do not I don't think it's game breaking, but it's extremely degenerate. It's just another another part. So do people that think you can just chase again, you will not be able to just hit <laughs> hit them after they footstool. It does not have that much <laughs> Like, you don't go that high. Oops. Yeah. Especially if I, like, mix up my direction. Like, if I drift fully, like, I go so oh far, <laughs> right? And then I can, I can also do... Yeah. Like, it's not free at all to get to chase them it's pretty it's pretty fucking stupid honestly it's like you go so, you go high but you don't go high enough to where you actually like can reliably chase them again